Hello YouTube, this is Harley here with another episode of Skyblock and you're probably freaking out because of my XP level and hotbar. Uh, I've been sitting at this mob spawner, or the mob grinder, for a while now. It was like two hours earlier today and for like an hour now. Of course, I'm not just sitting here staring at it. Uh, I usually just sit here, watch TV, and in every commercial break I'll come over here and kill the mobs. So, we're almost level 30. I'm really hoping this will get us to level 30. And uh, as you can see, I've gotten the arrow challenge. Uh, that's pretty awesome. I'm really excited. I'm surprised I've gotten all these done. Or, not all of them, but I've got a lot of them. I'll show you all my inventory in a second. Let's collect the rest of this. So, we got the arrows, like a stack and a half arrows and bones. Stack and a half. Almost a stack of string, but I'm going to need way more string than that. That is for sure. Because um, a stack of string is only going to give us 16 wool. And, yeah, that's not going to cut it. So, But now that we're level 30, um, that's what I really want to do. Plus, I wanted to get these arrows. Uh, so, since we have the arrows and we are level 30, we're going to enchant a bow at level 30. Because it's really hard to play, like, to go to the end and do anything. Because we keep dying off because of um, uh, the gas or extremely annoying. And then the, whenever I'm trying to kill a pigman, gas hit me. And this is frustrating. So we're, what we're going to do is so we can actually kill the pigman and get these gold nuggets. It's really important that we get those because uh, it is a challenge. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a, um, I guess you could say, trap uh, for pigmen. And, uh, I, of course, I can't do anything real fancy because, I mean, we don't really have much. Whoa, screen just got bright. Uh, we don't really have much to go off of because, <laughs> oh, I did get a CD from uh, from the mob grinder. Um, that's pretty cool. I spawned myself a water bucket also just, just so in case you're wondering. Um, let's take a couple of these. Do I have another CD? Yes, I got two. Uh, but we can't do anything real fancy because... Of our situation we really don't have uh, much to go off of uh, as like we can't use water in the end we don't have pistons uh, stuff like that so all we really can do is is make a flat surface and let them come to us and we can kill them so that's the idea all right so we need a couple of resources here I grabbed some extra extra food uh, I think we're gonna need more than this of course uh, I'm gonna need this last wood oak Definitely going to need more than that. Um, I don't know if I'll chop it on a tree yet. I mean, I guess one would be fine. I don't have any more crafting tables. Uh, we'll have to see. All right, let's go ahead and make a, a bow and enchant it. I thought I grabbed three string, didn't I? Maybe that was the arrows. My bad. Um, I just have a feeling I'm going to need more arrows, but I don't want to die with all these arrows on me. So, we need a bow, and now let's go enchant. I hope we have enough levels here. We may not, but I believe we have enough sugar cane um, in case uh, we don't have enough bookshelves. This does not look like enough. I mean, this is one, two, three, four, five. That's eight. We need, we need way more than that. I guess I didn't expect to ever get to level 30. Uh, I was surprised. I mean, overall, it took like three hours uh, to sit there. But um, I was surprised how effective that was working. All right, we should have enough. I just don't have any wood on me. So we're going to have to chop down that tree. Dang. All right. No big deal. I can chop down the tree. So let's, let's grab uh, us an axe. I uh, moved the bed over there because at night time that's not as efficient. So that's the reason why my bed's down there. Alright, so I'm going to chop down this tree and get these bookshelves made real quick. Uh, I'll just do that off camera because, you know, it's uh, not too interesting. So I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I chopped down the tree and uh, made the bookshelves real quick. Um, nothing too hard there. Uh, let's lay down these bookshelves so we can get level 30 like so. And no torches are in the way. So let's enchant this. I really would like infinity as the number one. Okay, power five, infinity one. That's pretty good. Um, I'll take it. I will take that. So now I don't have to worry about losing the arrows. Now I'm just going to worry about losing the bow. Uh, so let's put all these arrows in here. Um, and then, oh, except one, of course. And then these stacks of arrows can be the challenge. We created a bow. 
and we got a stack of arrows. So that challenge is complete. Uh, I have a backup sword. Uh, I got a little bit of cobblestone on me. I collected some, not much left though. I grabbed some uh, nether rack because we're going to need some more building blocks. So I grabbed that. Let's see. What else do I think we need? We have string in here. Does it like not fit in here? There we go. Uh, string is very valuable. Oh, I think that's where I put my string that I laid out. <laughs> I was wondering where that went. Okay, uh, I don't need the axe. Uh, torches, possibly. So let's, let's take some coal here. I think we're good to go, guys. Uh, so let's head on to the end. And uh, I'll kind of lay out my design of what I want to do for this uh, uh, pigment farm. All right, now, of course, I called this the end. I meant the nether, but anyways. So what I want to do for this uh, pigment farm, I just want to do it right here out of the base, uh, nowhere real far away, and uh, we're going to cover this hole up. Um, I'm going to make it level um, as, uh, I guess, as this, and we're just going to level this whole area out. Uh, too high. I don't want to make it much higher than too high because uh, then gas may spawn or whatever. But we're probably, we're just going to do a bunch of clearing. We're going to make like a little tiny, uh, like room, um, I guess you could say. And then uh, for, uh, for me to safely stand. And then the pigmen will spawn outside of the room. And uh, where they spawn, um, it'll be one level higher. And hopefully I can like run in there, hit one of them, and then they'll all chase me. And then uh, we'll, be, we'll be killing them like this. Let's see here. See if I can show you exactly. So uh, just kind of imagine this whole area. So we're going to be hitting them like this. Just like a mob grinder pretty much. And uh, so we'll be uh, safe behind blocks and uh, they want. So it'll be a lot of formatting the room. That is for sure. I'm going to have to like uh, lay level stuff out and lay blocks down and stuff. So it might be a little bit more work than I'm expecting. But uh, it'll be good. We'll just kind of work it out a little bit of a time. And uh, once we can get the gold ingots to complete the challenge, it'll be all good. So uh, we de we need to level this part out. And then I'm going to square off the room. So I'm just going to do a little bit of off-camera work here. And then I'll show you guys uh, what I've done. Alright guys, so here's kind of the basic concept. So I uh, just squared off a room. Uh, nothing too fancy. And um, or kind of rectangle, but whatever. And uh, this this side's on, well, I kind of started, uh, so they can spawn like on this little spot. Of course, that's unlikely uh, considering uh, how many openings and stuff that uh, other places they can spawn. But the bigger I make this uh, outwards, um, the better it'll be. But I ran out of cobble because I'm using this as a marking, so I'll know like, hey, don't break this block. It's important. <laughs> so uh, I'll probably put cobble ring. We also need to half slab this. Uh, so they don't spawn inside of our base. So that'll be important. And um, I just have to keep mining. Uh, just keep mining out as far as I can go. Um, just uh, too high. And uh, just go in a big, I guess, circle, triangle. Or not triangle, circle, rectangle. All the way around. Uh, my goal probably today is to do about five blocks that away on every side. Um, it's not really that big the likelihood of them spawning here now is unlikely but i think it'll be nice if it'll work and maybe we can get some uh gold ingots and possibly try out some gold uh tools i've heard they're terrible but maybe they're better than stone <laughs> they probably won't last as long but maybe they're better uh i've never actually tried them so but everyone says they're really bad but we'll try it out because i mean i have no other purpose for gold whatsoever uh on this so We'll definitely need to try that out. So I need to get some more cobble because we're completely out and half slabs. So I'm wondering if we have any cool looking half slabs in here. Uh, no, we don't have anything. Uh, we do have s smooth stone. So let's uh, let's grab all this cobble and let's make these smooth stone into stone half slabs. Uh, a stack. A stack and two. That'll be good. And... Uh, Got a quite a bit of nether rack. Don't really need this much anymore. Oh, my bucket of water's with me. No, leave that here. <laughs> I do not need the bucket of water. Don't need the mushroom. So uh, let's head back over there, and I'm going to continue working on this some more, and I'll just show you guys uh, 
Uh, more updates the more I get done. Alright guys. So here's our first victim. <laughs> Actually I don't want to hit him just yet. I have a feeling that uh, one of them will come up behind me. So the last thing I really need to do is to seal off the ceiling. So they don't like drop down on top of my head or something. Um, but I did do this um, part. We'll need to lower this portion so I can put half slabs on top of it. If I, if I put half slips now I can't. I can't get to the edge, so I'll have to lower that whole thing. Um, it's not a big deal. It, it didn't take too long. It took a lot of picks, I must say. It took about six picks to actually uh, uh, do all do that five wide. Um, that one started at six, but um, most of these have like caves leading off. I blocked the caves off um, to a certain extent, like right there. You barely can see. I blocked it off. So that uh, like stuff won't come in or whatever, um, or they won't go out. Um, uh, and uh, the, the downfall of that, they won't be able to come in. But uh, it's no big deal. Um, I'm wondering how this is going to go. Uh, the problem about this right here is there's a giant cave above me, and they could spawn up above me instead. Uh, that really sucks. So I don't really know how I'm going to. Uh, go about fixing that besides maybe uh, pouring lava up there so they won't spawn uh, but uh, nothing I can do about it right now well so far uh, we got one of them spawned so that's that's decent but we're definitely gonna need more than one so hopefully the bigger I make this the better it'll be and stuff but I'm gonna continue working on this I'm gonna get the floor done for you guys and I'll show you uh, show you how that looks whenever I'm finished Alright guys, so here we go. This is what we got going on. Um, I ran out. I actually went back and got more. <laughs> and I still ran out, so that kind of stinks. Uh, but that's that's what we got so far. Uh, we'll probably change it up. Maybe you do some decorations. I don't know. Oh, uh, I remember that you can smelt this and make nether bricks. So we might actually work on that on here. I think it'd be kind of fun. But I think it is time for him to die. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was great. Only two, man. That's, I think I, we should go have some fun. <laughs> two shots? Man, that, that should be uh that shouldn't be too hard. I'm gonna go down here and die, I bet. Uh let's let's go um let's go kill some pigmen then, uh while we're at it. Might as well. I mean I didn't spend three hours sitting there waiting for this for no reason, so uh can actually kill gas now that's awesome all right so pigmen are gonna be angry at me so <laughs> I need to be a little aware of that oh my gosh this is the problem I always had I just heard a pigmen I just heard a pigmen or was that a gas I don't know there's one over there see like this whole area is lit up Oh, that is so cool. Oh, he dropped one. Yes. <laughs> we got one. Oh, that guy's mad. Oh, yeah. This is awesome. <laughs> this is a lot easier uh, with the bow than uh, trying to do it with the sword. Oh, come on. Oh, you got to be kidding me. All right. So, I need to be aware of where the pigmen are. We need some more of them, dude. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. I just seen him spawn. Great. Come on. Drop some more. Yes. Oh, sweet. He dropped one more. So, the problem is we need, like, nine for one ingot. So, I mean, that's, that's quite a bit. Oh, man. I wish I could get rid of these gas. There's one. Oh, Dadgum it! Oh sweet! Oh oh no 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 no! <laughs> oh, he came out of nowhere! Oh man, this is great! <laughs> There's one over there by the entrance. I need to be aware of him. Oh yes, another one. <laughs> this is a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Uh, like, I was thinking I was going to have to make that trap and do it. Come on, man. 
Ah, I can't get rid of that guy. Okay, I see one over here. We need to take him out. Yes. <laughs> this is awesome. All right, I'm going to keep working on this, and let's see how many we can get going on. Because uh, I've only had one, one predicament there. So I'm going to keep killing them, and let's see how many uh, nuggets we can get here, guys. Holy crap. <laughs> that is a lot of pigmen. Oh, man. I only got five so far. I'm kind of terrified to even do this. But we're going to try it out. Wow. I hope one of them doesn't come up behind me. Man, this bow is awesome. It's only a two shot. I mean, that's I mean it's quite a bit, but still it's really good considering uh that. So let's see. Got one, two, two of them. Dang it. <laughs> I was expecting more Oh wait, wait. No, we got four. Cause uh, if you look at it, I guess I didn't see them. They look really similar to the uh XP orb, so it's kinda hard to tell. But all right, I think we're done for uh, now with this. Um, I sat here for about 10-15 uh, minutes, and a lot of them they really don't drop them that often, so that's the that's the annoying part. I mean, it's like one every five I'll drop a drop a a nugget. So, but we have enough for uh, one one of those uh, ingots, which is awesome. So uh, I want to be really careful when I get up here. Because if there's something up here, I am screwed. <laughs> oh, man. Let's... Come on. Oh, okay, it's just that guy. <laughs> I don't even know if they can fit through that. Can they? Nope. <laughs> nope, he cannot. Alright, so that's that's awesome. Let's make this nugget... Or ingot... These nuggets into ingot. And then uh, let's see, uh, see how many more we got. I think we have one in our chest from a while back so I'm also gonna need to start working on uh, getting more cobble and stone because I used it all and uh, we have a lot of netherrack now from uh, doing all that mining and stuff so that's awesome alright so let's see here we have one yeah we only have one so we only need we need nine to make one of these right boom there it is <laughs> we got one gold ingot awesome okay another thing we can do is uh make a fishing rod uh once again and try to do some fishing um i really don't know how this is going to work because last time it did not work at all so let, i may sit here for a little bit and work on some fishing because uh, we do need to get uh 10 cooked fish so uh but i have a feeling we need to make this way bigger or oh i had a better idea i could go down here and try to fish in like Oh, down there and try to fish in the actual like pond instead of trying to fish into the makeshift one um, so maybe that'll work hey <laughs> there's a creeper but all of our animals that are over here are gone now I guess I killed them off see there's a bunch over there but I don't really want to build over there and considering that the XP farm is working a lot better than it did it's not really that big of a deal so I can fish here, I guess. I don't know how it's going to work. But I'm going to sit here for a little bit and see if we catch anything. Yes! I think I found the sweet spot. <laughs> I'm actually catching them. And surprisingly, um, it's actually working. Like I sat here for like probably a good minute and a half just staring at it. And it finally uh, started bobbing. And if you can tell, it's kind of bobbing. Not really. Um, but I got two... Um, apparently you collect XP from this. I did not know that. Um, I don't know if y'all knew that or not, but I am collecting XP from, uh, fishing, so. But, I wish they would, like, give more for this. Oh, sweet. Uh, because, like, it just seems like this is so boring. <laughs> Honestly, I'd rather just run around with a sword and kill pigs and stuff. But, um, I just wish fish, there was more an uh, incentive to actually do the uh, fishing in the game. I mean, I'm glad it's in the game and everything. I just wish those... Oh, wow. I didn't mean to actually get that. I think we may actually be able to finish this challenge, guys. <laughs> this is awesome. It's working very well in this little tiny hole. Um, but that's sweet. So I'm going to continue with this. Hopefully, we can get these 10 fish. Looky what I got. 
I got a sheep on the end of the line. Oh, it's a creeper. I'll blow me. Um, so I only got five. It just seemed to quit working. I'm wondering if I could drag the sheep really close and then yank. But I'm not for sure. So maybe he'll, like, the further I go, maybe the more he'll come to this way. Or did I already lose the line? Yeah. Okay, never mind. That's what I thought would happen. So um, if we could get a sheep... It would be a lot better than doing what we're trying to do. Uh, but I just don't see it happening. And I, like the way to do it. Let's see if we can try the way that I think would work. But see like my platform's not good. I don't have any wheat. I mean I don't see it happening right now. Not even prepared. But if we can build just a tiny platform. And then build up. So... Let me go up. So get a hold of him. No, 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 no. Okay. And then yank. Holy crap. Stay, stay. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, he died anyways. As I said, I wasn't prepared for it. But uh, that's the way it's going to work. <laughs> Dang it. I was so close. I really need to use this for uh, fish instead of <laughs> trying to get the sheep. But if we get the sheep, then I can use the rest of it. Because if we get a sh uh, the sheep, two sheep, uh, white ones preferably, and we can just continuously breed them and kill them, and we would get one wool. And that would be, oh, hey, it's raining. That means fish bite better, right? Um, if that was the case, then we could just kill off the baby every time and get one piece of wool, which is four string. And that's just as good than sitting at the mob grinder for I don't know 10 15 minutes but anyways guys uh but th I think that's all I got for this episode um we got some stuff uh some progress made definitely and uh, I am very happy about that and uh I'm glad <laughs> because these challenges some of them are just so overwhelming like the um like the wool challenge there's like five or six uh different types of wool and 10 each and that's like 60 wool that's uh i don't know 60 wool times four that's how many pieces of string we need and it's just outrageous but i think we made progress for sure and uh i hope you all enjoyed it so uh but that's all i got for this episode guys i'll talk to you guys later